like these kids nowadays, it's like, they, they get out there and it's like, I was just kicking it with everybody from the school, right? Right. I just looking around like, man, any, any, anything can happen out here, man. Yeah. You got a lot of homies done and everything. So I'm like, man, we need to figure out how to get together. That's true. Uh, Perhaps uh, there are even times when we recognize this spirit in ourselves. Thank you, Rick. We are not perfect. We are good. Just for that, they tell me that I'll never be part of them. But don't you understand? I'm a different thing. Words matter when I speak, no matter how to my feet. But don't you understand? I'm a different thing. Words matter when I speak, it's time I speak the truth. Me and, and inspire me 
give me like uh, different ways to be independent as, as you know a young person who would just go to school, get a good job, you know, go to college, those types of talks, you know what I mean? And we I went to school, you know what I mean? I graduated high school, I went to college for a while, I played basketball in college, but then my life, you know, it changed. Like it started getting real. It's like, hold on, you know, school and and all that stuff and, and work is good, but then like when when your life hits you, it's like that stuff is separate than your life, you know what I mean? It's like it's two different things. So uh, I, I encourage everybody here to, you know, uh, do something outside of what you're doing, you know what I mean? School, like how much do you guys want out of life? I make necklaces and stuff like that. I got a couple with me just to show. Oh, I thought you were coming in the battle. Oh, yeah. I sell these. Five hundred. What's up? Ten dollars. I can put them right here. I got more. But just stuff like that. Like, little stuff like this. Like, I feel like, you know, more than just a job. Like, you know what I mean? More than just uh, working is good. You can work for a job, a corporation, and then you can work for yourself. You know what I mean? Like, uh, and there's plenty of different ways that we can do this. You can, as simple as this, making necklaces, making bracelets, you know, making clothes. Like, I, I don't know if women's in here that you're doing clothes, doing hair. Like, there's so much that we can do, but we just, the TV and uh, the people around us, our influences, our environments, where we at, has influenced us to just go to school, go home, watch TV, you know what I mean, just sit around type of things. And it's just like, if y'all want more than that, y'all got to do more than that. Like, you know what I mean? There's a lot more that you can do. There's a lot more that we all can do. You know, like uh, Mario was speaking on just, you know, uh, the young people out here dying. I'm like, man, the young people is going harder for what they believe in than when I was coming up. You know what I mean? Like, everything is changing. Like, the young, everything is changing from, uh, from when I was in school. So, I'm like, man, y'all, the young people got a lot of, a lot of energy. Y'all got a lot of energy. Not, not to say that I'm not young. I'm only 25, but, you know, I mean, that's why I'm doing this. But, uh, yeah, 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 I feel like that too. Like, I'm young, and that's why I'm doing it. A lot of older people ain't doing this. Like, my mom and dad didn't tell me about my culture. You know what I mean? A lot of people didn't tell me about my culture and other cultures. And, you know, I did all this on my own. I started researching on the Internet, you know what I mean, YouTube, reading books. You know what I mean? I learned about uh, alkaline at, at, uh, acids and pH scales and how this affects our body. And this is all in the food. Like, so, man, I mean... It's big, y'all. Like, life is bigger than just what what they are telling us. Like, you know what I mean? Like, life is bigger. There's more than just just these little simple things that we do do on the daily. So I'm just I'm just trying to encourage you know, y'all to. What's up, bro? What do you eat, Daniel? Since you eat all, I know you eat vegan, but like, what kind of what else do you eat? Vegan? Tofu. Uh, nah, nah, not nah, tofu. No. That's, that's soy. That's the soy is a GMO. People think about that. Right. Like, we think. Like people that, that eat meat, you feel me? When you think about a vegan, you instantly think about tofu. Right, right, right. Yeah, I mean, that's what I said. What else? Because it's like veggies, basically, like more vegetables, natural, natural about right stuff, like stuff that's natural. You go and throw it down. Some things don't even eat additives. Like because you know, vegans eat vegetables and fruit. Some vegans won't even eat fruit directly from the supermarket. Because a lot of that stuff is sprayed with uh, pesticides. Like, yeah, and there's a lot of, um, like, I, I eat, like, uh, I eat grains, and I don't eat no fish. I don't eat no meat. A meat is acidic, bro. That's, uh, so on a pH scale from <coughs> 0 to 14, you know, 7 is neutral. Anything above 7 is alkaline. Anything below 7 is acidic. You know what I mean? So, uh, meat, all meat is acidic. Like, it's a fact. Like, y'all can look this up for y'all The bacteria that we are getting is coming from the food. Like, a lot of food is made through bacteria, you know what I mean? Like the milk, pickles, you know, I just figured out that, you know, pickles are made from cucumbers. Like, I, I thought that know. was, I didn't know that, you know what I mean? I didn't know that. 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 Short attention. I mean, like, yeah, I eat, uh, I, so I eat only fruits and vegetables that have a seed. Like, anything that doesn't have a seed is is a GMO. That's like saying you're going to have a kid without no seed. So all those grapes that don't got seeds in them, those ain't good for, you know, stop eating them seeds. Stop eating them grapes without seeds in them, them watermelons without seeds in them. You know, they're trying to make it convenient for you. <laughs> I didn't even know grapes had seeds in them. Yeah. Really? You buy a seed, that's great. <laughs>
I started to say that again. I'm a pescatarian myself, but I, I still eat fish. That's me. What's up? What's a pescatarian?
My, you know, I was talking to my brother over here, and he was telling me like he made he made a good point. He was like, uh, when you buy a car, you don't you don't be like, oh my my car gonna break down anyway. I'm not gonna put the right oil in it. I'm not gonna put yeah. the right gas in it. your car. You know, what I mean, you're gonna take care of your car. So if you're gonna take care of your car, you're gonna take care of your material things. Take care of yourself. You know what I mean. Love yourself more. We say, oh, yeah, I love myself, but love yourself more. You know what I mean. Eat eat healthier. Care more for the people around y'all. Like it, it it don't have to be the way that it is. You know what I mean. It's all based upon the way that we think. Manifestation. Like man manifesting what you want starts with your thoughts. Your thoughts lead to the way that you feel. The way that you feel leads to the way that you move. Your actions. Your actions relate, uh, res, uh, give you your results. So that's manifestation right there, you know what I mean? Your thoughts, the way you think about the people around you, like if you change the way you think about people, then you'll, it'll change the way you feel about those people and then how you deal with those people to get what you want out of life. Like this is how you manifest what you want. Like it's, it's more than just prayer, you know what I mean? Prayer is good. That This is how you send things out into the universe so that... Um, you, it can come back to you because energy is real. You know what I mean? Scientifically, it's real. Like, but like I was saying, like we just need more. We need more care. We need to love more. Love yourself more. Stop feeling. Oh, I'm gonna die anyway. Stop letting these people make you all not care about what's going on in life. You know what I mean? Like, are we all brothers? We all sisters? We all one? We all united with everybody? You know what I mean? Like we here. We gotta share this world. Like if we all just killing each other, then. People don't even want to go outside no more. Like, I barely see people outside. Like, I be outside downtown, you know what I mean? I, I don't see, I barely see any colored people, you know, I mean, uh, black, Mexican, whoever. Like, you know what I mean? I see a lot of uh, a lot of uh, white people, not to, just, you know, not to be no certain type of way, but these people are outside more. Like, you know what I mean? Uh, we need to be more, we just need to be more aware of what's going on. I know black people out here scared, you know what I mean? Police killing people. We killing each other. I know y'all scared. Y'all probably scared like, man, I ain't, I ain't trying to die. I'm gonna stay at home. Yeah, like, last last, last, last meeting we had, it was a couple people that said they can't even take their children to the park or can't even go outside. Like, can you speak on that a little more? Yeah, I, I just feel like that, that's because of uh, that's because of what the, the news is portraying. Like I said, how we think. The way that we're thinking about this stuff that they're putting on TV is the reasons why we feel the certain way that we feel about stuff. And why are we so scared? You know what I mean? When they turn off the lights, what is everybody thinking? When you at home by yourself and all the lights go off, what's your what y'all thinking? Like, is y'all scared? No, turn the power on. Right. Some people are scared. I know grown people today that's still scared. Like, they scared of the dark. Power box. Power box. They got dirty. Like I said, it's wrong. There's black people that scared. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Did nobody start eating food? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but it's, it's good, y'all. I mean, for real, so I'm, uh, I'm open to everybody saying something. Like I said, this ain't about me. It's about y'all. Y'all know stuff about yeah, what's going on out know. here that I don't know. You know what I mean? I don't be in school no more. Like, uh, I be here and around as much as I can, but, like, this is about y'all. This is about y'all's future. This is about you all health. You know what I mean? Uh, y'all know y'all want to live longer lives. Y'all want to live healthy lives. Y'all want to live a better life. So we all just striving for better. You know what I mean? Just a better, just better more for so we can help the homeless, so that we can help our kids, so that we can help each other. <laughs>
right? Some niggas got plans. Uh, 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 right. How many people do you know that? But they don't get to eight to ten hours. That's only because they have sex. Uh, uh, they have smart they faster and said, let me leave this for my kid so he can have this. Just because you don't have it. You know what I'm saying? That got money. And they need to talk about her. Their parents were smart. They 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 aren't dedicating eight to ten hours of their day building somebody else's stuff. They built. They they quit their jobs or, or and they went and built something of their own. They built something of their own. And sometimes you can go through. Your, sometimes working through a business, you yeah, you can build something of your own out of that. But after that, you once again, you're not working on somebody else's stuff. Or like working on building somebody else's business, you're building your own thing. You feel me? Everybody can always have their own. Well, I think. What he's saying is true, and it ties into what you were saying. Take some of the time out of your day to put into yourself or whatever it is you like doing. Like, just like I'm here and I'm working, but I write books on the side. That's something else that I do. Whatever your gift or your talent is, it's not just so you can be super cool and everybody can like you. That's a way for you to make money outside of having to work for somebody else. So if you have a special talent or a gift or something that you're good at that nobody else knows how to do better than you, that's a skill set that you can use to make money. Because people most likely need whatever it is that you have a gift or talent in. And there's a lot of, I know everybody in here has ideas on their brain that they just like, you know, I want to do this. I, I think I can do this. If, if I, you know, made this little, because I got a baby, you know what I mean? I'm like, if I made a little, a baby powder to pat my baby, then, you know, I wouldn't have to sit here and do this all day. And I can, you know, this can put my baby to sleep. Just little stuff like that. Like, you know what I mean? Just ideas. We all have ideas. We have to stop being so distracted by TV, by people, and say, hey, man, you, hey, bro, can you come over here and uh, sit or uh, do whatever they is calling you to do? You know what I mean? You're distracted by people. People are distracted. You know what I mean? People are distracted. They want to be distracted with you. Some people don't want to sit by themselves and be distracted. So you have to. Basically, basically what you're saying, everything eventually is going to lose its value. So what you're saying is you got to put time into yourself. Like, you know what I mean? Go out and learn something. You know what I mean? Money. Phones, all that could be going tomorrow. What are we going to do? What kind of knowledge do we got? You know what I mean? Look, think about it. I mean, think about it. Really. I mean, just a question for the class. I mean, anybody just raising their hand. What y'all what y'all going to do without phones or what y'all going to do without phones? I'm going to write a motherfucking letter. I'm going to play basketball. Yeah, I'm going to play basketball. What is that going to be? What is that going to be? Look though, look though, take this out, take this out. But I'm saying, help me understand, help me understand. You know what I mean? Basketball, that's cool and everything, but really, what is that putting in here? This is the only thing that's never really going to lose its value. You know what I mean? People used to tell me, you better keep the fuck up. Man, I don't want to hear that. You know what I mean, but it's real. It's real. I'm starting to get older. I'm starting to realize how important knowledge is because shit, you got Trump and Hillary fucking shit up right now. You know what I mean? Oh, excuse my language. Mm -hmm. I'm saying like, you know what I mean? It's like we gotta have knowledge. You feel me? That's that's what we gotta have. We everything gonna lose its value. What we gonna have, man? If if this is taken from us tomorrow, if they wanted to shut off all phones or do all this, they could. They could. So all I'm saying is we need to get together. You know what I mean? And we need to learn something. Put some time in yourself. Right. I be on Facebook all day. I ain't gonna lie. I be like, man, I'm gonna ignore her message. I'm gonna respond this message. Like, no. Yeah, being distracted by everything that's going on around you. Facebook, the TV. Like, how much stuff are y'all distracted by on a daily? You just walking somewhere. You smelling something that you, you know what I mean? Just everything. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Only because we only got time and everything. My bad. Yeah. I just uh, kind of ask. So, uh, what's your plan? What's my plan as far as uh, like what I'm gonna do with my life? Yeah. Man, I'm gonna continue to build my business. I'm gonna do my necklaces. You know what I mean? I'm gonna do my music. I sell my music. I sell necklaces. Uh, I'm getting all this new thing, uh, this this Cajun water, which is uh, it's an alkaline water that has been uh, put through a machine that electrolyzes the water. Like and, it purifies it. It purifies it. Yeah, you can say that. And um, it uh, it helps the body. It heals the body. You know what I mean? <coughs> I'm gonna start with there, and then I also I'm learning how to farm. I don't know if anybody knows Kanok or uh, the Israel farm. Yeah, um, I'm, I work with him, and you know he's teaching me about farming. So really, I'm going to, I want to build my own everything. Like you know, what I mean, I want to be able to live and sustain for myself. I don't want to be paying no bills to nobody, giving nobody nothing. Like I don't have a job. I work for myself every single day, like eight hours plus. You know, what I mean, there ain't no eight hours for me. Like I do this all day. Like and that's what it's gonna take for y'all to be able to. Invest in yourselves. You think eight eight hours is, is bad, you know what I mean? But once you love what you're doing, it's not like, oh man, I'm sitting here eight hours a day. I'm a, I'm I gotta do this. Like it's not like that for me. It's just okay. I'm I'm get, I get tired of this, and then I turn around. And I do something else. I'm let me do this. You know what I mean? I turn around. Let me do this. Let me call these people up and just continue to build. You know what I mean? Like I wanna I wanna get somewhere. This is how you are gonna get places. You have to take the steps. To do these things, she's writing her books. You know what I mean. She she probably puts a lot of time into reading other books, getting ideas, uh, and just you know what I mean, experiences from your own life and taking the time out to write. You, you did with, you hear a little bit of your music. Oh yeah, uh, uh, spit a little something. Yeah. Uh, Number sixteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sixteen, uh, straight sixteen. What's up with it, man? Uh, I got one. Uh, mind racing. What would they do with this information? I know what's coming, I'm getting impatient. Too deep for conversation. Close your eyes and feel this sensation. Empire building X will be the nations without manipulation. I see what people doing nowadays and no longer in it for their entertainment. See them on another hype. It didn't happen overnight. I don't need a thing from them. Everything's gonna be all right. Everybody got a reason. We've been through that growing season. You gotta go within yourself. That is where you find the freedom. Fat from all the chemicals. Eat a lot of vegetables. They think I don't know what's going on because it ain't visible. Not living in the physical. They just been ignoring it. That's going to be the reason why they stunt their own development. Mad at everybody else like you didn't do this to yourself. You just say the word, but you don't know what our ancestors felt. I got Mr. Lewis came out to the school good, for Crisis Mind good, and everything. Um, he came out to speak to, to the fellow students and everything about what it is to eat healthy, stay positive, what it is to stay together as a community, black community. Start at the schools. You know what I mean? I'm coming at Burbank. I'm coming at Sac High, and I'm coming at Johnson. Uh, we're coming. We're coming, we coming to Florence too, man. That's we my coming old to you. school. You know what I mean? So, uh, <laughs> we coming. We coming, bro. We coming. So, you know. You know, we we got we got to be together as a community. That's that's step one. You know what I mean? So that's what we want to start with. So I want to appreciate you. Yeah, man. Love and respect, man. So, I'm not gonna make it out there till like three. So, I know, so that should give me enough reason to change, but you know, it's kind of difficult to conquer the game. Waking up every morning wondering why I'm in pain, covered in blood, I use a couple shots to clean out the stains. So, I see my dad drinking to me on D, they say the apple is all too far from the street. Now listen, I ain't him and he can never be me, but I'm giving him for the things I was forced to see. Now my Harsh memories embedded in me, but I am not a normal human, I could never repeat. I seen lies in the skies with these pair of eyes, ain't no paradise lights to gamble, where's your paradise? Mm. I realize that I'm confused, they was where it's right and watch the closest ranch, man, I swear I couldn't see that night. Damn, but it's all good though, watch me bless the hood though, perform a miracle of ascension and watch the hood grow. <laughs> it's funny how my demeanor misunderstood though, infected by the fact that they hating riding with Satan, I'm waiting. I'll be patient, I make it, hard to contemplate mistakes that I've been constantly making. I'm doing all this for a reason I swear this night got me feeling